guys, Coach Joan here, coming to you with a snack for this week. So when you need something quick, um, and that's a great option, we have this ricotta cheese snack jar. Now give it a chance, make sure you test it first, because I said, ew, and now it's all I want. So test things, um, try things that are new, and enjoy it. All right, I have a little helper today, so that we can get a great video, and we are going to start. So here is first the ricotta cheese, and that's going to be one protein. She's gonna put that into this jar for me with the spoon. With the spoon so it doesn't go all over. Good. Yum, my favorite. So that's one red, which is great. And then we're going to use half of a fruit. So my favorite are raspberries, so we're gonna put those right on top. Go ahead, Savannah. Right there right on top of the ricotta cheese, right? Wow, this is a small jar. You get that all in there. And then we top it with, I use a half a teaspoon of vanilla. There you go, don't spill that. You can do it, you can do it. Here she goes. <laughs> There's not a lot left in there, I don't think. Go ahead, you can, it's okay if a little extra goes because you have it over perfect. Put that in, let that soak in, and we put the lid on. Perfect, so we put this one to the side. This is one of my favorite snacks. The next one we're going to do is blueberries. So Savannah's going to put the ricotta cheese into here. Yum! Looking good. Don't miss any, because this is like, you know, snack. And this is a snack, this is not a meal. Um, and that is good to know because we get hungry, right? Um, so here we go, she's putting that in. And the next one calls for blueberries. So first, before we do that, Savannah, let's put the vanilla in so it can soak into the ricotta cheese, okay? So she's gonna put it right over and pour the vanilla. She's good at this. Savannah loves to cook. I didn't know if you guys knew that or not. So she really likes to help me with these videos. And while she's getting that, I'm gonna get the blueberries. So we want about a half of a fruit. It can be a little more than half or a little less, depending on how you count it up. But you want it to fit in your jar. And this recipe that I'm going to post also would call for a dash of cinnamon. So you could put a dash of cinnamon right on top. It says stevia on the recipe uh, as well, but we don't. I don't feel like it needs the extra, so I won't add it. You can add it if you want. Um, you can also add um, a whole teaspoon of vanilla if that's what you want to do. Put the lid on that. That's it. So we have our first one that we made here, which is with raspberries. The second one is blueberries, and it's almost like a little blueberry cheesecake. Uh, this is one of my favorites as well. So now I have them made, and I could just grab them right out of the fridge and be ready to go. And everyone asked this, so I'm gonna tell you quick. Where did I get these containers for my fruit? Bed Bath & Beyond. It just keeps the berries nicer because I eat a lot of berries during the week. You know what we forgot? The chocolate chips. Uh, in the one with the raspberries, um, I usually put a half a teaspoon of chocolate chips, but that's not a lot, so I usually do the whole teaspoon. So we'll add that in, and we'll see you next time. Oh, look what's happening. So she's gonna eat them, and then, <laughs> but I'll add some in when I open my jar. Thanks, bye.